dealt with a very rare weather phenomenon overnight. It's called a heat burst. It caused a huge change in temperature in just a matter of a few minutes. Here now to explain just what happened is meteorologist J.D. Rudd. Kind of interesting. Yeah, and both those events actually tied together that wind gust that we had and the heat burst. The wind gust actually came first at about uh, 1057 last night, measured 69 mile an hour winds, <laughs> then some gusts at around 50. Then it was about one in the morning we had this heat burst. Let me kind of show you the temperatures. This is what happened last night. Let me cycle you through this. Get a load of what exactly happened. Okay, so we'll stop you at about midnight. The temperature in Wichita was 84. Watch what happens just an hour later, spiking up to 101 degrees. And then we went back down to 79. That's exactly. Here's the best way to explain this. We had storms across the area last night. You have winds that keep those storms aloft. However, those storms weakened last night, so those winds they let the storm fall apart. This air fell out of the sky and hit the ground. It then compressed the air already in place. When you do that, you heat up that air. Now, if we go look at this from the bird's eye point of view, you've got this hot air in place, and you've got those strong winds that came out of this system. Outflow winds, it pushes that hot air across the area. It happened right over Wichita. Matter of fact, three different sites around the city, mid Conant Airport, Jabera Airport, and McConnell Air Force Base, all at about 1 o'clock last <laughs> night, measuring the 100-plus degree heat, then things subsided. So there's the basic overview.